They have a large hill to climb here as they go up against Luna and Pugsy. Let's get into it. And there's the Finn. And what better legend than to tack on a ton of damage than you having to Blax, right? Sidelight Nair, you're in orange. Stomps Air, you're in red. <laughs> that's, that's what it's going to look like. Luna on the Roman Reigns, which is what he did so well with in, in the crew battle yesterday, is going to be what he's opening up here in game number one against Delta Designers. We're getting right into it on Mammoth Fortress. Yeah, yeah. this just feels like a strong team. Like, you know, like they're, they counterbalance their weaknesses. You know, Thor actually has a pretty good amount of defense, so maybe I would have to stock or tank a little bit if uh, Pugsley starts taking too many hits. Speaking of, oh, oh no. There it is. Wow. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, taking the first stock off of uh, Pugsy there. And Luna, I Ooh. saw him go for the stomp into jump chase dodge recovery. Little bit of a input flub there. Got the gravity cancel side signature, and that's what left Pugsy open so that way they could go for that 2v1. But Delta goes down as a revenge knockout after that, but man, Luna just barely surviving that side air. But so far, I feel like when I was saying this, I was kind of reaching, but that, that fact about Pugsy, Pugsy just got back on the stock, by the way. He mm -hmm. took two side light nairs in the ground pound, and he's in red. Yeah, it's, <laughs> not, it's not looking so good for Pugsy uh, <laughs> right now. Definitely having by far the lowest defense on the uh, screen. Not that's going to be Brent, but she's like got middle of the road stats, so she's been yeah. for quite a bit. Brent's like the most balanced yeah. when it comes to stat lines. <laughs> you, you just you pick a stance, which I'm like, I feel like moving faster. Yeah. All right. you're, you're not losing anything. Yeah, her base stats, five, 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 seven. That's seven in speed. <laughs> Everything nice. else, middle of the road. Yep. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Put a little pressure there on the, on the left side on the stage, but oh, scooped! Not Whoa, gonna send him too scoop, far though. Dang. Wait, okay, and he takes down Pugsy. Yeah, it's like he got the scoop on uh, on Brim, but it looked like Pugsy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, so when you said that, I totally agree with you, and I went. What? <laughs> like, like was, yeah, so it was so stacked that Repugsy ends up going down. Zyder goes afterwards. Team combo. Oh, yo. I like the double weapon throw coverage there, and it actually just takes Delta out. And now a stock lead. This is one of those deceptive leads, though. It's like, mm -hmm. yeah, it's a lead by stocks, but if, if Pugsy goes down right after Luna, it's done. And two Sidelight Nairs means Pugsy's already in red. Yeah. <laughs> there goes, all right, there goes Luna. Can Pugsy escape this, uh, the double axe coming up from Zyder and Delta? Yeah, well, I feel like with, in, this, in this game in particular, that's like the flex point of the game when there's two uh you know two one stocks they're like very healthy and then you have one person with two socks they're super hurt and then the uh, other person is one stock and they're hurt because it's like this game can flip off of one ko straight up yep. and that's exactly what happened now there's a little bit of a oh there was a oh, bit of a lead of up and four of the blue team hold on though they are all Ooh, hurt really <gasps> oh. fire Oh, that's so brutal. The neutral stick just clips Delta, but the Sider comes through. Sider does not get the pick up on the DLI, but Pugsy and Luna are both on the edge recovering here. And Pugsy, a little too afraid to get anything committed, and that recovery can't come through as Luna was too worried about the team coverage coming out from the blue team. Delta gets to the recovery, but no, Sider goes down, and Pugsy survives through all of Scoops. it. And the scoop for the double knockout. Wow. Pugsy really did an incredible job surviving there at the end and letting Luna just take the reins there. Uh, five stocks at the end, but I was about to be like, oh, Designer and Delta are doing exactly what I was like, what's the one way that they can win? Oh, take down Pugsy yeah. and immediately and then focus on Luna. And they just barely weren't able to do that as Luna was able to navigate perfectly fine. But I think I think everybody on that screen knew that. I feel like Three, you had pointed two, out that Pugsy has one, like, he, literally for like that last 20 <laughs> seconds, he didn't throw out a single move. <laughs> and, and I was like, yeah, but the thing is, you know, the, obviously there's a lot of kill power here on uh, Finn, aka Jala, but you know, if he whiffs anything, he could die immediately. And so he's like, yeah, I'm just going to be, a, I'm bait. And you can just kind of clean them as they keep trying to chase me down. And that worked out perfectly for them to stay uh, alive in that first game. So good stuff to the red team as we uh, move over into the second game with them having a victory in that first one. I will say that's just like a, a huge compliment to Pugsy's movement. Yeah. Because the thing about Finn, doesn't even have that high of a movement stat. It's like dead middle of the road. So he's getting run down by Bryn from Zyder all day. Yeah, high nice. force, high dex, and that's what he's looking for when he has those both of those weapons. That's the play style that reflects how Pugsy likes to play. Ooh. Delta goes off the top though, and Pugsy, surprisingly, the one with the least amount of damage on the screen in this game. He was taking, he was taking all of that that momentum, all of that like don't get hit mentality, just brought it in the Beautiful. next game. And look at that, he is now the only one with three stocks on the screen. He still isn't in red. Well, Silent Nair fixed that. Oh, what? Luna, why? Uh, Luna's like, get out of here, Delta, trying to save you. Everyone, Luna oh, goes wait down. a minute. Oh, that's oh, huge. Oh my gosh. Man, I, I, I felt the ground pound so hard right there. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. The, instead of the down air, I, I, mm -hmm. I would have ground pounded. Uh, probably could have died, most likely. But hey, you know, it does send a little harder down and at a better angle as, as far as trying to get someone under the stage. But either way, 
man, yeah, this now is rough. We, we have this like severely lopsided situation where Luna went down to that final stock so incredibly early, now getting pushed into the orange. Uh, Luna ends up having to play this back support role. Yeah, and it's a bit of a reversal when it comes to the legends that they locked in here, right? Like, Puxy, Puxy's not exactly the frontline kind of character when it comes to this, so the second that he whiffs one of those things, if Luna's not able to get in there quickly, uh, he could just get knocked out, and then Puxy, okay, team combo Ooh, oh, here. Oh, okay. No. Yep. Hit the fame, DI, yeah. use fame the action. same move in the same combo. And that is an aw like, it's, a, it's a small thing, so incredibly important in doubles, and that's the thing that you could just do. You said same move, still a knockback, you can DI it very aggressively. Yeah, just that. change the angle that you get sent flying. So it you almost looks like Luna combos. had it, though. I mean, it, it, you know, he almost calculated for, I think he was... Oh, with it, the stomp? Yeah, 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 he just had to jump, like, a little higher. So he didn't oh, know what? that it was going to push him a little higher. Just, uh, a little up. However, this game is flipped. It, it looked like Luna was, has been hurt for so long that, you know, this should have been a 2v1 a while ago, but Luna's been living on that, on well, on the edge. Yeah, Pugsy, we talked about bit. what Pugsy had to do and what mm -hmm. Luna's role was going to be, and I said it's going to be really tough, and what do you know? They do it flawlessly, but Luna... Uh -oh. Oh, that was a great recovery. And this is so... Oh, he went for the sideline cider. The weirdest situation. I can't believe sideline Nair sent Delta that far. <laughs> okay. Luna getting the... Oh, wow. the perfect wow, wow, wow. toss same right time. there. In the same time KO. Luna li really lived on that stock for as long as possible. I mean, I think that... That's probably half the game on that last and, stock right and, there. And while doing that, Pugsy got 752 damage. That was such an incredible change Jeez. in playstyles. It, it just, they're, they're, they're so malleable to the state of the game, I feel like, and yep. how they have to be able to play to defeat their opponents. That yep. We just got to see Luna and Pugsy basically, it, it almost felt like they swapped chairs, but that's not what happened there, right? Yeah. They just had to change the way that they played based Three, off of what happened two, in the early mid-game. It's Man. one of those situations where I feel like, you know, obviously they have a game plan they want to come in with. With this team, you're like, okay, yeah, you're in front, I'm in back. But no. if it flips, they can both still play the other side so well that it's like it, you know, it doesn't really matter. Like the team's not that rattled. It's just all right. We're, we might be a little uncomfortable. We're gonna make it work though. Yeah, being able to run that flex coverage. Mm -hmm. I mean, that that's what has them now on set point. Uh, Snatching victory oh. from the jaws of defeat, really, and continuing that momentum here into a 20-second knockout. Yeah, Man. that's huge. Delta went down super early on. In the last game, he did that as well, and Zyder and Delta were able to make up with that by taking down those Luna stocks super early, falling off the left side of the stage. But so far, Pugsy has just been dishing out tons of damage. Sidelight Nair ends up getting friendly fire, and Luna takes down Zyder. Can Luna make it back? Yes, okay. I thought he had way less jumps than that, but you, you can tell based on the sweating and Pugs didn't even have to go out there to be able to help him. I mean, that was about to be a quick trade. It yeah. was just a bounce off the wall, eating some of the force that, you know, kept Luna in the game. Yeah, I don't know what, what has happened to Pugsy oh. between the first and third game, but his illusion status went up to like 100, man. He's like, <laughs> well, he, he's a thief or a, a, you know, assassin or something right now because yeah. he is going crazy. He's just getting random bonus iframes. That's not what it actually is happening, but that's what it feels like because after that first game where, he, like you said, he spent 20 seconds not throwing any moves but mm -hmm. surviving the entire time it's like he transferred that into the next two games but he's also now doing like eight billion damage right? yeah, yeah he's, he's, he's clearly an assassin class that's, 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 you can't hit me but if i hit you i'm doing a lot so yeah. it is going a quite well for oh look over Whoa. here oh Delta. that's a turnaround <gasps> and there it is pugsy with the assassin class luna needed the assist off of it to clean up the and stock he turned but it man. into a stock for them in favor and he luna, came over that corner so fast. he there. really did like i didn't even see him get down there until he hit and i was like you you warped whoa, there bro whoa, whoa. Luna, okay the luna special he, around uh, the corner the triple grab he he goes down for it oh my goodness thank you luna that was the sickest hammer island i've ever seen be able to use the mammoth fortress the bottom of the stage to be able to combo into it and look at him off stage now pugsy joining with him is like look we've got three stocks let's oh go my. for it Gosh. Okay. Oh my gosh, dude. That was absolute destruction, man. Like, you can't, all you can do is just, you know, shake your head and say GG's on that one. And absolute destruction. Oh my gosh. That was goodness. so wild. All right, so that, that hammer play off the side, I'm sure we'll end up seeing it in the replay. But hammer recovery, you know, you take somebody above you, you throw them below you, and hey, what does hammer have for down there? The down air, which does the exact opposite takes them from below, throws them above. But he positioned himself under the stage to get the bounce off the ceiling so he could just rotate right through again. That was absurd. Man, uh, yeah, that, you know, it looked good in the first game. And, like, after that first, so after, good. after that, it was just all uh, the yep. Pugsy. You know, honestly, all the Pugsy show, to be honest. Oh. Like, he, he literally was like, all right, I'm never going to get hit again. I'm going to do billions of damage. Yep. I'm, <laughs> and I'm, we're going to win this game. And then, and then the worst part is that when you are actually able to deal with Pugsy, when you can get that hit in, 
You're fighting against Luna, who's just the best well, player in North America right now. Talks. Unbelievable. Actually unbelievable. Yeah, we got, yeah, some good replay is definitely going to come out of this on both sides, but it's just, you know, as as we get a little further into it, I'm sure you're going to see a lot more red replays than, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. than blue sides. <laughs> That's so. right. I'm just looking forward to that very final one where we got those stocks taking a quick succession. Wow. Okay, so he did hit Cider. He did. We weren't crazy. All right. yeah. It's just that at the same time, Pugsy got hit by a stare, like yeah. in the same moment, and it looked like the neutral stick took him down. There's that double knockout with the dare that was fantastic. And, uh, oh, man. Is oh, there it is. It? There it is. What? Yes. Oh, okay, okay. That was nah. all. That was the first attempt, and yeah. then the second stock he goes for it. Oh wait, there's just so much that happened. Yeah, there set. was. I mean, Jeez. I mean, there, there were just so many highlight explosive. clips throughout this entire set. That's why he had that perfect Actually weapon ridiculous. toss right there. Oh, this yeah. one he lived forever. So yeah. If only they had the same knockout effect there, that would have been that would have been wild. That was the recovery that Luna made. Okay. Ground Pound came through. This is the save where Pugsy just like materialized in anywhere in slow motion. It makes it so much easier to see. And then the recovery on the way back to take him down. And then he brings Delta right back down there. Oh, here it comes. Look at that. Oh, Pugsy hit him. I didn't even see down. that. I, even I didn't dirty. even. Oh, he got done dirty. My. Whoa. Dude, they're crazy. <laughs> I didn't even notice that Pugsy. He, he wouldn't yeah. have hit that recovery if Pugsy didn't hit him into, yeah. into yeah. the wall. That's that's true teamwork Actually right there. Disgusting. He's like, I know you just throw this move out. I'll put him there. Like <laughs> I will put them there. So look, Luna just gives like a little shrug. He's like, yeah, I'm just that sick.